Good evening. It's Wednesday. I want to talk about Malmö again, the gang raping that is going on. And I've been expecting some feminists to do something about this, right? And now there is one. Yeah. Hooray. Yes. <laughs> Her name is Hanna Hey, yeah. Uh, she lives in Malmö. And she is a feminist, absolutely. I think she's more like, she's also like uh, Antifa kind of a person. I found some info about her on Facebook. And uh, yes, she wants to do something about this. So she invited people over for discussions. What shall we do about the gang raping? Uh, what shall we do to make uh, women more safe in the streets? Ah, it's good, Hannah Heyer. Now, uh, there was an interesting thing here, because on the invitation she said this. Note, you who think rape is something committed by perpetrators of a particular skin color, who speak a particular language or come from a particular culture is not welcome. All right. So there are certain people who are invited and some people are not, right? There are certain opinions that shouldn't be allowed at this meeting. And I can imagine this meeting. Yeah. A lot of ignorance. <laughs> yeah. That's what I see. A lot of ignorance in the meeting. And what shall we do, right? If we can't have certain opinions. I mean, this is so silly. Yeah. Okay. So, I also want to tell you about this uh, gang rape uh, here in Stockholm. In the Stockholm sub suburb uh, of Fitja. Yes. I talked about this gang rape earlier where 20 guys were active yeah, yeah you remember maybe so um, five of them were prosecuted and they are now all free to go yeah uh, because of lack of evidence it was a very very poor police investigation one thing for instance uh, uh, this whole incident was filmed, yes, and this was also confessed by some of the guys who were there. Now, some of the guys were just looking, you see. Uh, apparently there were ten of them fucking the woman, or having sex with her, and about ten guys were just looking. Right? And uh, to free themselves, they claimed that there was a film. And the woman herself also said that there was filming going on. And now the police didn't find the film. Right. They never found it. And there was another thing. It took the police a year before they did a technical investigation of the crime scene. It was a stairwell in Fitya. It took them one year. And I also heard that they first uh, investigated the wrong stairwell, see? Yeah, I mean... So, anyway, the um, prosecutor would uh, appeal to a high court. See what happens with this. Disaster. Catastrophe, that's what it is. And, um, yes. And I'm, I'm thinking, well, now we have this gang raping going on in Malmö, right? The feminists are starting to take action, right? And then we have the police making a mess out of the investigation here in Fitja. So how do you think the Swedish citizens react to this? That's the million dollar question. And how do you think people will vote in the next election? That's another million dollar question. Right. 
That's the story. Bye.